Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to the channel. My name is Olive Kirote and this is Olive Kirote rebranded, also known as O N R. So I am glad to be back on here with another video. But before I get into the video, I want to let you guys know that we have an amazing documentary that is out. Guys, I have been working on the surprise that I recently launched on the channel for a while, for Lenny Sana, for disappearing for a while, but I hope you guys have checked out the video, the ONR documentary, and if you haven't... I am the founder of Olive and Kirote Rebranded, also known as ONR. This is your time to go have a look, okay? Because there's a really amazing surprise in that video and a lot of amazing things happening in the ONR brand, in the ONR company, okay? So this video is actually about an amazing company in the crypto space and I want us to talk all about it. As you guys have read from the title of this video, we're gonna be talking about Bitfinex. This video is brought to you by Bitfinex, and I want to let you guys know about this platform. First things first, if you are part of my mining masterclass, so I had a mining masterclass. I did not announce it on my YouTube channel. I mostly announced it on my Instagram. And again, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you're missing out because that's where the tea gets served hot first. So I had a mining masterclass, around 40, 50 students in that class, and we were actually purchasing the tokens for that company from Bitfinex. So I actually have a whole group of my students who know about this platform, and I'm really, really happy because now I actually get to talk about it and teach you guys more about it. So in this video, I want us to talk about what is Bitfinex, you know, how does the interface look? How do you sign up? What are the features? Why should you try out Bitfinex? And basically just a history, you know, type of video just to bring you guys in on what Bitfinex is and what it does. So if you're interested, if you're excited, if you're about to learn something new and you're just like, Olive, please, let's continue. Like this video, subscribe if you haven't, okay? Please subscribe if you haven't and stay tuned because we are about to get right into so, it. Um, Bitfinex, like I have already previously mentioned it is a centralized crypto exchange platform i have already mentioned that i've used it before some of my students have already used it before and it is part of the ecosystem in the crypto space and also buy sell and earn your cryptocurrency from it and i want us to go to coin market cap so that i can show you guys where bitphoenix lists on coin market cap and the amount of trading volume that they actually have So first things first, I am currently on coinmarketcap.com and when you come to coinmarketcap.com, up here there's an icon for exchanges. So click exchanges and then there are three types of exchanges. There's a spot trading where you would just buy crypto or sell crypto on limit order, market order. Then there's derivatives. This is a bit more advanced and then there's decentralized exchanges. And when you come to your spot, you'll see all the exchanges have been listed by CoinMarketCap. And they've been listed based on exchange score, the volume that they are trading in the 24 hours, their average liquidity, their weekly visits, number of markets, number of coins, and the fiat supported. Any top 10 centralized exchange platform is a good centralized exchange platform. Here is Bitfinex. So if you can see right now, Bitfinex is number 10. Um, we have an exchange score of 6.7, volume is $392 million, average liquidity is 555 weekly visits, number of markets is 379, that's pretty good, 175 coins, and the fiat supported is USD, Euro, Pound, so that is how Bitfinex ranks in terms of crypto exchange platforms in the world, and it's top 10, it's number 10. 
so that's a plus guys i was doing research on bit phoenix just trying to understand more about this platform and i found this amazing article by cryptohead.com i'm gonna link it down below and it was last updated on june 8th and you can scroll down and see the top exchanges according to them bit phoenix is a really top contender and what i'd like you guys to know about it is that i've actually learned is it was founded in 2012 and it was established in Hong Kong. So that was, that, that's really interesting. Their logo is a green leaf. They have 80 plus cryptocurrencies available. Their fees vary. Again, they support for fiat currencies. So that is it for the introduction about Bitfinex. What is the history of the platform? One of the key things of this platform and the history it has is security so it is a, it's something that kept popping up and i'd like to show you guys again this article by crypto head that i stumbled upon um and he mentions that their security efforts are nothing to scoff at either as they claim that 99.5 percent of all the funds on the exchange are stored in cold wallets offline and again there is another article that i was reading and 99.5 percent of users funds are always stored in a cold wallet however it actually has the remaining 0.5 percent in a hot wallet and it continues to say like how strict they are with their safety and how they need four managers to actually access these funds and i was like okay that's really interesting so for me i think that's one of the things i've learned in my research with bitfinex and it's something that i've seen because when you apply for your kyc there are a lot of steps generally there are a lot of steps so definitely have a look at that and maybe also read about that and see so i guess what i'm learning about the history of the platform is they're really good at keeping their users funds safe that's a plus so the third thing i want us to talk about bitfinex is the features of the platform What are the features of this platform? How does it stand out? What do they offer? And maybe just give you guys a small tip on their platform. So I'm going to be recording this from my desktop or rather my laptop. Feel free to download their app and have a look at it. I believe the app would be easy to use as well. But because of the video, I'm going to be using my laptop, okay? So I have logged in and as you guys can see, Bitmix colors are mainly green. From I've already created an account, I've already logged in and you can see they have a section for traders so features mobile app and all that then there's also a platform for lenders so if you're gonna be staking and if you're going to be lending or borrowing and then they have a drop down for about us so what you'd like to learn about bitfinex so from the home page you can see that it's showing you the prices of different cryptocurrencies in the market so you can see the ticker symbols here, their last price and the 24 hour change. Basically just a whole chart or analysis showing you what is happening in the market. So I'm going to return to platform. And now you can see that my Bitfinex platform has sort of changed. And it's saying welcome back crypto only so yeah there's trading there's derivatives if you're into trading if you know people who are into trading let them know about bitfinex and they can actually come and see there is also funding security otc and more so when you click more you can see there are other stuff which i'm actually going to talk about later and then when you come to your wallet you can see you can deposit withdraw wallets and reports again this is the main place for if you're trying to actually buy and sell and if you scroll down you're going to see this is the place you make orders so you can click a limit order market order stop order stop limit and i'm going to show you guys guys like this video and comment down below if you want me to show you how to buy your cryptos on bitfinex i am down to assist so yeah let me know let me know and if you guys can see actually i have bought crypto from this place before my order history is just snitching me so you can see i have made actually a lot of purchases from bitfinex so this is not the first time i'm using this platform so that is basically it um like i've told you guys this corner at the far left is where you're able to purchase your crypto from you can see the the bell icon is where you get your notifications and then your account so basically your account you can actually create sub accounts when you're trading this verification process 
and all that good stuff but again this is just the features of the platform and in case you're unsure of where to go always scroll down at the bottom bitfinex has broken it down in a way that is is chewable so if you're looking for services on trading staking and all that jazz it's here if you're looking for products how to pay how to borrow how to lend you come here if you want to know more about the company you come here if you want support this is how you contact support you go down and look at the four options they've told you if it's help center maybe there are questions there have a look at them if it's contact us exactly the same thing learn so learn is basically a section on bitfinex that allows you to learn how to buy a coin on bitfinex how to buy ethereum how to buy that coin if you click this link they will show you maybe an, a step-by-step -step walkthrough of how to do that. And then if you're into legalities and the privacy terms of using this platform, this is where you would go. All the social media links are down here below. Follow them on Twitter and follow them on Telegram. They're really active on these two sites. So on Twitter is where you learn about the crypto updates. So definitely follow them on Twitter. And Telegram is also a really good community that they've built. Find the links on the actual page. It's easier for you to not get the wrong link if you go to the actual website and scroll down and you'll find the clickable links there this is the telegram group as you guys can see it's a verified one 18,000 members feel free to view it and have a look at it and if it's twitter here is the actual beat phoenix platform so follow them on twitter they have 905,000 followers and you can get an insight of the crypto market updates i'd like to plug the african channels for both bitphoenix twitter and bitphoenix telegram so my african family there are actually specific platforms for us if you have queries if you want to contact support i will link them down below in my description box feel free to also follow those pages in case you have specific issues and you are in africa okay about us bitphoenix you can read about them here as you guys can see it was founded in 2012 they have different products so and these are the the leaders basically guys this is the team behind this company so feel free to learn more about so those are the features of the platform i feel like i've given you guys a small rundown of how you can access um the platform it's very easy once you just you know you know you have to keep looking at a platform and looking and looking and trying eventually it becomes easy so, this other part of the video i want to show you how you will sign up or how you're going to register and if you have not created an account on bitphoenix if this is the first time ever you're even hearing about this platform definitely use onr's link as these links are actually affiliate links that support the channel and also let bitphoenix know how many people that have introduced to their platform i've pinned the link that you should use I have also pinned maybe the code in case you just download the app because you'd rather use the app thank you so guys i want to show you how you would register and sign up on this platform so guys i want to show you how um you will be logging in so for example you click the link i have clicked my referral link and then it's going to bring me to sign up so when you're signing up, you'll see just down here before I start filling in, there is a referral code that has been added there automatically. Please note that it cannot be added later. You can't open the account on Bitfinex and then add the referral code later. So guys, please, please, please ensure to use the referral code that I have shared. So when you click the referral code by ONR, you're going to come up to the sign up place. You can use your phone. Feel free to use your phone as well. Or you can just log in from your desktop. Why do I prefer the desktop? Because sometimes you can bookmark the URL. However, it's also easier to use it on your phone. So feel free to download the app. So when you come here, just click the email that you want to be using. You guys know that I always vouch for ProtonMail because it's more of like a secure encrypted email. Feel free to use your proton mail but for the purpose of this video guys i'm going to be using my gmail because i already have an, an actual bitfinex email okay um and then i'm going to just create a username queen Oli, and then i'm gonna create a password so we can just suggest strong password um and then country of residence ensure to put kenya so 
you if you are in another east african or just african country feel free to use your country you can click this um if you want to be part of the bit phoenix community and be sent emails if not don't click it and then just click sign up okay so you can see the second step is you need to use your google authenticator to secure your account with two-factor authenticate authentication so you can use google authenticator or authy i personally use authy because it's the first one that i got introduced to however if you already use google authenticator feel free to use your google authenticator scan the qr code and ensure that you've secured your bitfinex account with 2fa so i'm gonna just click here continue and you need to scan this code so why this is better if you used your laptop first is because on your phone you can actually scan the qr code and get the authenticator id or rather the authenticator code then now eventually you can now download it on your phone so I So you can scan or you can click the setup key it's going to ask for the authentication so i'm gonna put the key word so it's zero two one one eight six and then i'm going to say enable setup complete thank you for confirming your token and authentication is now set up on your account and please confirm your email address so confirm your email address and finally the sign up is done that is pretty much it you're all set we've got everything for you to get started so what i'm gonna do i'll just put my email because it's already been saved on the platform and i'll click login and then again i'll put my two-factor authentication because i have already set it up so it's 500 714 authenticate and there you have it guys i have logged in in my bit phoenix account before we continue you have to agree to the terms of service again if you are into reading all these legalities which i believe is the best thing to do but assist is going to believe that they don't mean to harm me i'll just click yes <laughs> i agree but i do think it's actually important to read so if you'd like to understand more about your account um i want you to come to verification so the thing is the first type of verification we've done is the simple verification which we've done in email address confirmation and 2fa but and actually here it is guys this is the basic one and if you can see here you can deposit and withdraw digital assets you can exchange trade and you can do otc so and you can see the requirements of the email address like margin trading margin funding public pulses you'd have to start the verification process for that and you can see there is official photo id biometric photo and phone number done now if you want to go into deposit and withdrawing stable coins guys now this is another thing for me let's say you want to deposit usdt busd usdc die or all these other stable coins you'd have to reach the intermediate for this one you probably can deposit like litecoin and other like non-stable coins but if you actually want to deposit stable coins you'd have to make sure you're verified until intermediate the derivatives trading bitfinex pay like paying your merchants using bitfinex pay you'd have to now do a second official photo id and proof of address most of the time proof of address can be anything that shows your address maybe a telephone bill or your water bill or your rent bill or your bank statement if you don't pay utilities in your household and then the final one is if you actually want to do bank wires and link your bitfinex account to an actual bank account sis bro you gotta do the full one and now this one requires your bank statement so in my other account i'm actually on the third verification i'm yet to do the final one but i'm going to actually do it because i do want to see if i can link my my bank with bitfinex and actually buy crypto okay so that is basically how you sign up and i wanted to show you guys that process liquidity good fees a really interesting interface you might need a bit of learning and a bit of getting used to but it's not bad and security again is like one of their major major
pros. But there's something I learned about Bid Phoenix that I did not know about, but I had said I'm gonna tell you guys. Paper trading is a feature on Bid Phoenix that allows new traders to test their trading strategies. So maybe you're not an investor like me, but you're trying to learn how to trade. I believe you can use the paper trading section. So you can see here, I've opened the tab. Again, guys, always scroll down and then find the topic and just click. So you can see here, paper trading is a simulated market environment where you can develop your trading strategies. Um, on Bitfinex, newly created sub accounts can be set to paper trade. So basically you can learn and strategize um, and then they're showing you the, the tokens that are available, BTC, USDT, USD, and test AA, test BB. And these tokens do not represent any value and can only be treated in this mock environment, which I guess is the sub account, okay? And through paper trading, you can learn and strategize with exchange margin and derivatives trading, margin funding, which lets you offer and reserve test funding, Bitfinex borrow, Honey framework to create custom order types, and even the OTC trading desk to experiment with large orders. So basically, with paper trading, you create a sub account that will allow you to trade. So this link has actually shown you as well how to open but i'll go to my bitphoenix account and show you guys when you click this account person thing here come to sub accounts when you click sub accounts it'll bring you here you can see my username and then it's saying i can create a new sub account once you create an account you just click paper trading account so we are going to do that right now how you set up your paper trading account um you can see on the far left it's showing test btc test aaa i am not a trader but i feel like there's some learning curve that you need to actually be able to use this part of the platform search on that type of content on youtube search for paper trading tips or trading tips or find um telegram groups or just you need to learn however i just wanted to show you guys step one plan a for anyone looking to start their journey i hope i've plugged you somewhere so yeah guys that is pretty much it for this video i feel like guys if there was a bit phoenix quiz 
at the end of this video you guys would actually answer the questions correctly and that is it for today's video like this video comment down below what video you'd want us to do about beach phoenix would you like to know how to buy how to sell how to withdraw how to deposit if you want to learn anything else definitely feel free to comment down below i love you guys remember to start where you are use what you have and do what you can Mwah. bye guys see you on the next one